greetings. My name is Reverend Dr. Pamela Dawn Hancock, and I am going to start doing a series of these little videos because in November, I'm going to be launching a Kickstarter for Mythic Mapping, which is the product of my dissertation where I created a self-directed game-like system for self-analysis. So if perhaps you cannot afford to go see an analyst or a therapist that is Jungian, uh, or if you're just looking to do deep soul retrieval work on your own, this process will allow for you to deeply engage with the self, capital S, and all of the internal archetypes four times a month, which includes two sessions with me per month, and I'm just really excited about this launch. But in the meantime, I wanted you to get to know me better. I am the Assistant Professor of Spiritual Practice and Care of the Soul and the Director of the Chaplaincy Program at Star King School for the Ministry. And as such, I take spiritual practices intensely seriously. I would have not survived deep postpartum depression without both my Jungian work around self and my spiritual practices around spirit. And one of the ways in which I do my spiritual practices is every morning I do yoga and asana yoga as in yoga with the body. And then there is nada yoga which is yoga with sound and so yoga itself are ways in which you can connect to the divine so there are many ways of doing that not just what we understand in the west as physical yoga so asana yoga which is with the body but there are lots of different types of yoga so my morning spiritual practice consists of physical using my body and postures to really focus the mind and connect to spirit. And then sound yoga, which allows for more of my brain and audio function, ears, senses, to be engaged through vibration and therefore centering and connecting me to spirit. So in Mythic Mapping, you will be guided to create practices that help you center and understand who you are and help you live a better life through understanding who you really are as a person. And every single person's needs are completely different. We are all individuals, but we can all tap into different ways to connect to self and spirit. So I'm going to share with you a little bit of that sound that I do every morning. And as it is autumn equinox, I thought that doing a sound meditation that is based in balancing both your upper and lower chakras, as well as balancing the left and right hemispheres of the brain. So I will be using crystal singing bowls look like this for the chakra and we will have one that focuses on the energy of the root chakra, one that focuses on the energy of the heart chakra and one that focuses on the energy of the crown chakra. So allowing for all of the places within to become in balance this way. And then I will be using tinkshas, which are a Tibetan musical instrument to balance the left and right hemispheres of your brain. Okay, so feel free at this point to close your eyes, take a deep breath in, out through your mouth with a, again in, one more time in, and if you wish, just close your eyes, listen to the sound and really think about how you can bring yourself into balance on this day of equal light and equal darkness.
taking another deep breath in. Perhaps on your exhale, imagining roots growing deep into the earth. And then you take another inhale. And then on that exhale, imagine branches growing up into the sky. You are rooted you are centered, your own axis, navigating through the world, centered, relaxed, empowered. Thank you for joining me today. I'll be creating these short videos over the course of the next couple of weeks so you get to know me better, so you can understand my philosophies better. And then eventually I'll be launching some special videos specifically about mythic mapping and the work that you'll be able to engage in on your own and then in community starting in 2023, where you can become a fully realized archetypal being, wholly embodied and wholly, completely 100% being your own self. Thank you so much. Have a wonderful autumn equinox and I will see you in the next week. Bye.